Now, I want us to look at every video where this man killed his girlfriend. We woke up to sad breaking news of a man that kills his girlfriend. Why? I see that there's a lot of GBV going on. Even here in SA, we have a lot of GBV cases, but mostly it's men killing women. It's men killing children. Why are our brothers are doing this to us? Why, when someone decides not to be part of your life, you decide to kill them? Life goes on. And there are many fishes in the sea. Why, for your life to go on or to be happy, you need to depend on someone else's life? Why do you decide to kill someone just because they don't want to be part of your life anymore? Each and every person in this world has a right to be to whoever they want to be. So no one has a right to kill someone at all. If the person promised you the world that they will be with you until death do you guys apart, and the person decides tomorrow, you know what, I no longer, I, I have feelings for someone else or I have decided to end the relationship. That does not give you the right to kill them. Yes, it's, it's, it hurts to lose someone you love. It hurts to lose someone you love, but time heals. Time heals. You can always meet another person. You fall in love to another person and you'll never know. It might even tend to be the best thing that has happened in your life. But you go and decide and kill someone else's child. Why? What that man did to that girl is so uncalled for. It is unacceptable. Killing someone just because they don't want you in their lives you are just digging a, a very bad grave for your life. Imagine sitting in jail just because you decide to kill someone else. How are you going to live with your life knowing that you have taken someone else's life? How do you expect the community and the family of that child or of that woman to forgive you? How do you expect them to go on? So it's not only about you and the person that you have killed, no. It affects everyone around you guys. It also affects your family as the murderer. Yes, it does affect your family because how are they going to live in the community while they, they being scrutinized, criticized because of your wrongdoings? When someone says to you they don't want to be part of your life anymore or they have decided to move on with their lives with someone else, let them go, let them free. Enough is enough of gender-based violence. Enough is enough of the men killing our sisters, our children. Enough is enough. This has to stop. This has gotten to a point where, where families and communities have decided to take the law into their hands because they are that angry. I am not saying it is the right thing to do for communities to take the law into their hands, but people out there are very angry. 
It has to stop. It has to stop. Trust me, we all don't want to raise boys and girls in a society that is not safe. We all want to live in a better country, in a safe country, where we know that even if you send a child to a shop at, at let's say at night, around nine, and the shop is even closer, the person doesn't have to look back at their shoulders all the time just because someone else might come and hurt them. GBV is very bad, gender-based violence is bad. And this goes vice versa, guys. Even if you are a woman and a man decides to leave you, don't go and hurt another person. Don't go and hurt another woman. Don't go and hurt the guy just because he decides to leave you. Life goes on. You need to take time, heal, speak about it, get a very good support system so that you can move on with your life. Killing another person just because they don't want you in their lives, it's a no-no, it's unacceptable, it's uncalled for. More cases that we have more especially in our African countries. It's men killing women. It's men killing children. Dear brothers, it's bad, it's unacceptable, it's uncalled for. Try by all means to heal. Try by all means to get a good support system. Try by all means to see a psychologist. Try by all means to seek help so that you can heal and move on with your life. If you value and love that person so much, set them free, let them go. Killing them is not a good idea. Please let's share on the comment section, guys, on how to move on how to heal please share those advices let's motivate others on how to move on after a breakup because killing someone just because they don't want to be part of your life it's so uncalled for and unacceptable